Welcome to the Show Jumping School. You wouldn't enter a competition without knowing the basics, would you? This simple exercise will help you become familiar with horse handling. Let's get down to work. Let's get started. Warm up by following the path I made with these cones. You can control your direction by rotating the Wii remote left and right. Look down at the horseshoe marks on the ground. They represent the coming strides and thus your current trajectory. Here we go. Well done, but that was just a warm-up. Other exercises are waiting for you. Good, you will improve your knowledge with the next exercise. Stay on track, your path winds a lot more this time. Rotate the Wii remote left and right to turn. You should slow down before a tight turn. That way the strides are shorter and your turn is easier. Your horse is used to this. Observe his speed and look at the speed gauge at the bottom right of the screen. Very good. You're learning fast. Good. I'm very happy with your progress. But it's only the beginning. Let's move on to the next exercise to learn about your horse's gates. This time you have to control the speed of your horse. To speed up or slow down, press up or down on the control pad. To speed up, you have to tell your horse what speed you want to reach by setting the speed gauge. Your horse will understand your command when you release up on the control pad. You have to go through the cones at different speeds. Walk, green zone of the speed gauge. Trot, yellow zone. And gallop, orange zone. Start at walk and I will tell you when to speed up and slow down. Besides the colours, a green strip above the gauge will show you the correct speed range. There you go. Control your horse. You are not at the right speed. Start again and watch your speed. Right, at trot now.
speed up to a gallop. Well done. Go back to trot now. At walk now. Stop to complete the exercise. Congratulations, you controlled your horse well. Very good, but stay focused. Work on the gates some more before we move on to something new. Stay focused because this time a signal above the speed gauge will show you the speed you have to reach while going through the cones. Be careful, the signal will move after every cone pair. Let's go! Perfect! Now speed up, the signal moved. Careful, the signal is narrower. Last one, slow down. I'm impressed. Carry on like that. Now you know how to handle your horse. But show jumping is also about jumps. You will learn to approach a jump correctly in the next exercise. Let's move on to more serious things. You will jump over six jumps, but don't be afraid. Your horse will adjust its speed and jump without your help for now. You will still adjust its path to approach the jumps correctly. Your horse will refuse to jump if you're not facing the jumps. Go on and don't forget that the horseshoes symbolise where you're going. When you don't know where the next jump is, look in the same direction as the rider. Congratulations, you're a great team. You made it look easy, good job. Now do the same thing, but this time you have to keep an eye on the timer and watch your horse's gate. 